Thank you. We could both tell her. No way! Why do we have to tell her? Mum was sleeping together. If she bumps into Martin, he's going to tell her anyway. It's better coming from us. Hi, Mrs. Hillman. Hi, John. I did tell you to make sure nobody went in David's room. Oh, he's not still whinging. Well, I think I'd be whinging if I had a can of lager spilt all over me carpet. Sorry. Well, there was no structural damage, so I suppose we should be thankful for that. So you had fun then? Yeah, we did. Didn't we? Yeah. Come on. I'd rather stick pins in my Mrs. Hillman? No! What is it? Well, I uh, will tidy upstairs if you like. Oh, well, uh, gift horses and mouths spring to mind. Thank you, Todd. I can't believe I practically cleaned the entire house and you still haven't told her. Oh, there's Martin. See what I mean? Don't forget to tell your mum then. No. Good. you got to tell her, Sarah. Why? You know how upset your mum gets when you keep stuff from her? If you tell her, at least we can enjoy being together. She says my grand. Just call me, yeah? Look at you. Oh, it's wonderful to see you without that headscarf on. Thanks for the money. I'm sorry I didn't see you, sweetheart, on your birthday. Just a bit awkward. Oh, it's OK. Oh, those lovely. Are there presents? Yeah, um, this one is from Todd. Oh. And this is Amethyst. It's my birthstone. That's from Mum and Richard. Ah. Oh. Didn't they be seeing much jewellery this year? Oh, one of Richard's home schemes paid out. Got a big cheque. Did it? Oh, well, that is good news. Yeah, Mum's a bit happier. Mm, I bet Richard is too. Uh, when did all this come through? The other day. Sorry, listen, I'm going to have to go and get some stuff for Bethany. Yeah, that's all right, my darling. Now you come round for a trim any time you want, all right? Bye. Bye. Hi, Todd. Don't suppose you feel like doing this lot for me, do you? Uh, not really, no. Oh, can't blame me for asking after what you did this morning. We need to talk to you. Yeah? What is it, Sarah? There's nothing to worry about. Are you sure? Sarah and I... Well, we've been seeing each other for a while now, and... Yeah, and we really care about each other. What are you trying to tell me? We're sleeping together. Could we talk about this in private, please? I want Todd to stay in, Mum. But we have been careful. I should hope that goes without saying. And we didn't rush into anything. We talked about it, didn't we? It's a pity you didn't talk about it with me. Mum, we're telling you now. After the event. Well, seeing as my opinion seems to matter very little, I don't know why you're bothered. I guess she told you then. Well, I'm glad you're honest. In fact, I'm very proud of you. Pity Mum isn't. Well, as a matter of fact, I am. I don't think I was very fair the way I spoke to you earlier. He still expected us to ask permission now. Anyone else for a cuppa? I, uh... I just thought that after Bethany, we'd have got over any secrecy or embarrassment about sex. Yeah, but Mum, that was about being pregnant then. This is about how I feel. Just doing what everyone does, because we love each other. I know you do. Hiya. Hiya. How was Simon's? Yeah, we're all right. What's going on here? It's just me and Sarah having a chat. It's allowed, isn't it? Oh, one of those. Uh, just so you know, Sarah and Todd are sleeping together. They told me today. Oh. Well, that's very responsible. Can't ask for more than that now, can we? <laughs> 